What's up, y'all? It's your boy Clef Mikado. We back at it again with another video today. Today, we actually go make a nice and quick, simple video. I'm actually gonna try to recalibrate the throttle on this car. For those of y'all who are tuning into the channel for the first time, my car is a 2019. The 2019 model challengers hit the showroom floors about fourth quarter of 2018 to early 2019. I didn't pick my car up until April of 2020 with only 45 miles, brand new. So I actually wanna see if this little throttle recalibration is gonna help out and if I feel a difference. Now, I know y'all been watching my zero to 60 videos. I might bust one of them runs and after I do the calibration and see if that helps out with it. But yeah, man, I just want to see if that takes away some of the lag that I've been feeling a little bit. So I don't want to take too much of y'all time. We gonna go ahead and jump right into it. Let's get it. All right, y'all. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. So the first thing we're going to do, we're going to go ahead and turn the car on. We're going to put it in the run position. Car is now in the run position. So we go wait a couple moments for these lights on the dash to cut off. All right, the first light cut off, and I think we should be Gucci. So now, show you what I'm going to do down here with my foot. We're going to go ahead and put our foot on the pedal, and we're going to go ahead and press down slowly. And we're going to hold this for 20 seconds. All right, so we went ahead and we held it for 20 seconds. So now we're going to go ahead and slowly release off of the actual pedal bingo so now we're going to turn the car off place our foot on the brake go ahead and power the car on and voila so we go see if that makes a difference yeah so that is how you recalibrate or relearn your actual throttle so now we about to go ahead and give it a test so we about to go ahead and put this thing in drive so right now we about to cruise like this, no sport mode. I just want to see if it makes a difference, man. So let's go ahead and let's go for a nice little run. All right, y'all, we headed up my front gate now. Whoa. Oh, we might be on to something right here. Let me see. Oh, hold up. I got to show y'all this, man. Lambo. That's crazy. But you know what? I'm about to go ahead and gas this thing. So far. Oh, shit. Hey, hey, it worked, bro. <laughs> I swear it works. Let me get over this little hump real quick. I got a couple little bumps, a little speed bumps. You're going to see the camera shake it, shake up a little bit. But, hey, I didn't think it was going to work. I swear to God, it works. Yeah. Yeah, that's him. Got this. Even the exhaust kind of sound like a little, a, a little bit different, man. And y'all know, even though it's not that big of a mod, I got the actual Hellcat air filter on the car right now. I'm going to put this thing in sport mode, but so far, hey, it works. It works. So I'm about to put the car in. Let me, you know, I don't need to stop. I'm going to just put it in sport mode real quick. I'm trying to let this slow truck. I hate when I'm out filming, man, and these, all these cars want to try to figure out what I'm doing. But I got the car in sport mode, and my fuel light just came on, so we about to head to the gas station in a minute. But let me go ahead and punch this thing in sport mode. Yeah, it's safe to say that it has a... Alright, yeah. That's him. That's him right there, boy. Wait, hold on. Let me go around this curve. Yeah, it's safe to say that that little trick actually does work. You can, you can feel a difference. For You can feel a difference for sure. I don't know how it's going actually perform in the zero zero to 60 run or if it's gonna uh, you know actually make a big difference 
if you got these you know 245s on the back still and improve your time but i swear to god i man i swear i swear if you got a challenger or you got a charger you gonna want to try this asap try this asap for real I swear, man. Look, you know the zero to sixty runs, man. You can't. I can't hold the camera at the same time and and, and, and film because I think that messed my time up. But look, right off the right off the dribble, I hit a five point three. Right off the dribble, man. And I know y'all gonna be talking smack out there because hey, I didn't know my tank was low. But I'm about to do one more run before we hit the gas station real quick. Hey, bro. I swear. Try it try it but i'm gonna do one more run real quick and see if i can beat this little 5.3 my best time was 5.2 i'm gonna give it another shot but make sure y'all go ahead and do that uh throttle recalibration relearn because it's definitely it's de oh shit it's definitely snappier bro i swear to god I'm about to give it another shot though real quick and I'm gonna put the camera down but hey man I'm laughing too man cuz YouTube is hella funny I was I'm thinking about this one comment uh, somebody said about improving your 0 to 60 time uh, I think somebody had they turn the traction control off and the wheels kept spinning out of control and somebody in the comments was like how the hell you think you go get a good 0 to 60 time and you got your traction control off man i don't know why i just randomly thought about that but yeah i'm about to go ahead and try another run man hey y'all look i'm running him best time right there 5.1 hey best time right there 5.1 Woo! Woo! i feel like i accomplished some best time y'all saw it. too bad i couldn't film and i had to focus on f i had to focus my bad <laughs> I'm excited right now. I had to focus on actually hitting the throttle, man. I couldn't do it. I can't hold the camera and drive. But as y'all can see, for those of y'all y'all who've been tuning into the channel for the longest, man, y'all know my best time always showed 5.2. It's no way you can cheat this right here. There's no way you can cheat it. Hold up, man. Let me readjust my lens. Look at that. 5.1. 5.1. So as soon as we put these 275s on the on the back, I think we go be in. I think we go be in the game. We go be hitting them fours for show for show. So I'm gonna give it one more run, and I'm gonna see if I can beat this 5.1. Yeah, we gonna make it do what it do. All right, y'all. So I did another run. We got a 5.3, but that was user error. I got a little bit of an audience right now. So I'm about to get off this street before the police come and start hawking you boy. But make sure y'all do that calibration. I don't know if that's what helped or what. But as y'all can see, once again, man, 5.1. 5.1. And we go in the video just like that. So if you're new to the channel, make sure you go ahead and you smash the thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you drop a comment. I appreciate every single one of y'all. And we're going to be back next week with another video, man. I'm excited right now, man. Y'all be safe and y'all stay careful. One.